around. Uh, oh, what a night. There it is. Huh? Oh, oh. <laughs> Builders. Sun. Ship. Trelawneans. Master. I can't read. Whoa, whoa. Reality check here, guys. Do we actually believe Bozo's gonna give us a ship just because we show him Captain Bone's map? Yes. Sure. I don't know. May I help you? Yes. Thank you. We wish to speak with Squire Trelawney, the shipbuilder. We need a ship. Too bad. The squire's in Long Nedry for the grouse season. He will return on the feast of Saint Lulu. Lu, 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 lu. Oh, that's that. Well, of course, his rich half with Sun Young Squire Trelawn is here. We'll see him then. <laughs> well, gentlemen. This is definitely a genuine, bona fide round map. Oh, really? Oh, yes. Mr. Limbo told me so. Oh, Mr. Limbo lives in my finger. He's very smart. He's been to the moon. I smell ozone. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well done, Beaky. Now we know that is definitely too much ground powder. Actually, Squire, we were hoping to meet with your father. We need a ship for an ocean voyage. Ocean? Hmm. Ocean? Ocean? You know, the ocean? Uh, the big blue wet thing? Say, I know what's happening here. You chaps are planning to sail to this island, aren't you? Ooh. To dig up this ground... Yes. yes. Well, that settles it. We'll use one of my daddy's boats, and I will personally finance the voyage for the ground myself. You'll do that? Really? Certainly. What are rich half-wit sons for? <laughs> welcome, welcome. Ah, 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 ah. There she is, the Hispaniola. Oh. Wow. Woo uh, Come on, let's go. Yeah, let's go. Look, there goes Jim. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, oh, look! It's the boat steering thing. This is called the Red Hawk Gates of Hell. Uh, hey, how does it feel, Captain Hawk? Feels like we're really doing it. It feels like we're finally having an adventure. Yeah, I'm starving. Where's the kitchen? Mm, something smells good. Button in the long boat till he's sober or lying no more. <laughs> what have we here? Stowaways. <gasps> I'm afraid we shish kebab and barbecue stowaways on this ship. I got a lovely recipe for black and red. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I know. You must be the cabin boys. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, in my galley, you're always welcome to help yourself. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> Yahoo! <laughs> oh, yes. Um, <laughs> well, he's got a healthy appetite. And you must be Master Hawkins. Yes, sir. Oh, you needn't be calling the lowly ship's cook, sir. John Long Scissors. At your humble service. But we're just cabin boys, Mr. Scissors. John Long to his friends. And believe me, lad, a friend you can trust is worth his weight in cheese. Ha 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 Beware running with scissors. What's the matter, lad? Oh, that? <sighs> I had to replace every part of my once strapping, virile pirate leg with this useless hunk of garbage you see before ye. All hands on deck! Come on in, lads! Chop, chop! Look lively now! The captain will be here soon! Who's that? Oh, that is Mr. Oh, the first mate! A capital fellow! <gasps> the captain approaches! Piping aboard! Captain! Abraham! Smoke! Smoke! Good day, Mr. Earl. Oh, 
You must be the cabin boys. Uh, yes, sir. Which one of you is Hawkins? Uh, I am, sir. I knew your father, Jim. He was a dumb, stupid, weak, pathetic piece of human garbage. Ah, the wind seems to be freshening. The tide is with us. Mr. Oh, oh, this voyage has begun. This voyage has begun. Raise the gangplank. What is? Let go of the gangplank. Let go of the gangplank. Hold the gangplank. Any man caught dawdling will be shot on the gangplank. Uh, I didn't say that. I was just paraphrasing. Uh, Mr. O'Donnell, just set the gangplank. Set the gangplank. When the course is weighed and the anchor's weighed, a sailor's wage is waiting. With a flag unbound and our hearts unfurled, we're underway and off to see the world. Underway and off to see the world. Hey ho, we'll go anywhere. I'm trying to clean all this up. The wind is blowing. Manly men are. Mm. Sailing for adventure on the deep blue sea. Safely now, Mr. Cesar. You old sloppy. Well, there's an informed opinion. We laugh at the perils we're facing. Every storm we ride is its own reward. And overboard, I call it my people. And overboard, my people call it. Hey-ho, we'll go anywhere. <sighs> the wind is blowing, boys, the sails can sing. Sailing for adventure on the ocean blue. I love to see them cry when they walk the gangplank. I prefer to cut a trout. I love to hang them high and walk the little feet. Try to walk in the air while their faces turn blue. And this is supposed to be a good life on a boat. There are distant dance with burning slams that pull across the oceans. There are bingo games every fun day. Readers at the midnight will say, But I order drowns more than you deserve, you villainous dogs! <laughs> hey, oh, <laughs> Hurry, Rizzo! I'm going as fast as I can. The wind is blowing, should have took a drop and drained the train. Sailing for adventure on the bounding bay. The salty breezes whisper, who knows what lies ahead. What the hell are you doing? The stars will be a marble compass. That idea is just the worst. Wherever we may roam, and our drinking mates will always be just like a family. And though we may drink, sport, Rome is always home. All right, Mr. Limbo, I didn't know you had such a good singing voice. You're welcome! We'll chase our dreams standing on our own Over the horizon to the great unknown Hey ho, we'll go anywhere This does not look safe! The wind is blowing bold and brave and free Sailing for Rome! It's so nauseating! Sailing for Rome! So exhilarating! Sailing for Rome! Thing. <laughs> <laughs>